Alright, so this is for the mini quest Wandering Galal. So which what we gotta do is talk to Tsar Galal Kot. After using the Ring of Visibility on the Ring of Stone somewhere outside the Tazar city. The requirements of brink, brink of its extension. The Desert Treasure quest partly. Exactly 730 obsidian shards in the backpack. That's what we have here. Recently recently do donated Toko to the Fight Cauldron Coffer. Which is in the Fight Cauldron. Which is right here. A Toko Zo Uncharged Equipped. We have it equipped. Do not wear any obsidian armor. And do not wear a fire cape or any kiln cape. Alright, so this is how we do it. Alright, so to get to the fight cauldron, you would teleport to Karamja. You would run all the way through Brimhaven, heading all the way to the east. And you would see this volcano, which is the Tazar city. You would enter inside, and once inside, you would run a little north, east, south, and then east again. And all the way over here to the minigame icon. And this is going to be the fight cauldron. It'll be right here. Right? So once you would head inside, you would right here. And then you'll see the coffer. So, you know, naturally, if you should have Tuckle, but if you don't, you know, do some Scal Zuck. Because he gives a great amount of Tuckle or just fight the Tazar here. And they'll drop it. So... You can donate 15,000 to get a temporary boost. And regarding to donate, you would have to wear obsidian armor. So let's just put on one of them. We'll put that on. And that's it. So you would recently donate it. And you can keep going on it. So if you want to, you know, if you want to be careful with the time, you can add it to 40 minutes. So, all right, let's put on back our regular armor. And let's see if that's requirements done. Right. So recently do donated Toko. Right. So now we got to find Galal. All right, I'll let you know when I find him. All right. So regarding the ring of visibility, you can go to maze quest chest in Verok and you can reclaim it back and to get the ring of stone you can come over here so you know from the fight cauldron over here you can just make your way to the main plaza and you will come to the gem shop so assuming you have a good amount of talk hole it's going to be 303,000 talk hole to buy a ring of stone here or you can just buy it off the GE same thing so I got over a million talk hole and we're going to go buy it. And there we go. That's how you get the Ring of Stone here. And we're going to try to find out where Galal is. Alright, so that wasn't too far. So, I used the Ring of Visibility on the Ring of Stone. And here's Galal. So, we're going to just go through the chat dialogue. Jelt, you found Tazar. You know, what are you doing here? Adventurers. Bake a cake in Lumbridge, fly a magic carp, eat fish, catch fish. He don't like the fish. Battle the dill. Fight with honor. <laughs> Drop things when things are defeated. You know, how come I couldn't see you? Only, jo only human in city can see uh, the czar. Oh, but how'd you turn invisible? The Mej teach volcano magic. Nah. Oh, so he was peeping. All right. Ah, uh, okay. You know, so you taught yourself the invisibility spell. Ah, uh, okay. You know what? Runes. Nah, he's saying he doesn't use runes? <laughs> Too much hassle and no pockets. 
<laughs> you can't just decide not to use runes. No. No. <laughs> Para que? Rune stones contain ele. Oh, he goes into talking about runes. Nah, so there may be a way to use magic without runes. That was interesting. Like how he said that. Can you teach me your magic? Ah. Oh. Nah, okay. Oh, okay, so he ain't gonna teach us. Alright, so, you know, can you read the language? Where ancient Tazar words? At the mouth of the la lava conduit surrounding the Tazar city. Ah. Oh. Alright, so, go. I'll meet you at the fight cauldron. And that's really it. That's how you do the, the mini quest. It was super easy. Alright, so we're back in the fight cauldron after the quest. So, we're gonna try to read it. You know you're having trouble translating the text? Very old words. Oh, okay, so you get to choose, like, what you want to read. Which of Takar Hawk's text do you wish to translate? Oh, okay, so, you know, I'm going to read it, and I'm going to probably... I'll, I'll give a description of, like, what I think it means. All right, so the preface, the first one was talking about how the Takar are the ones who speak for the masters to understand their thoughts. So, regarding the second one, the masters... It was talking about how it was basically describing jazz, how she's sand, so time passes, and then full, how she's fire and constancy, and then it just cuts off there. All right, so basically the third one, which is the great labor, the gods started creating worlds from sacred clay. And I'm assuming it's the same sacred clay from the mini game, because they threw all the sacred clay from the worlds that were imperfect, so they just destroyed those and try to make it more perfect. So throughout the times, they were created tools to make better worlds, and then after a lot more time, Full had created the Elder Kiln, and the Tokhar started working. And every time Full was unhappy, she, you know, she just took it away. And then the Tokar would learn from that, make the make it better. And then that's basically it. All right, let's go to the fourth one. All right, so the fourth one is basically saying how after all this time, they finally created their perfect world and Jazz set down the Elder Stone and I'm assuming it's the Stone of Jazz, and it said it purely expressed her power. And then the Masters didn't speak anymore because they created their perfection. Or their perfect world. And let's go to the last one. And the last one is saying how the Tokar is like, the Elders don't speak anymore. And they're waiting to hear more orders from them. And that's basically it. 